Hi everyone. Well, you know, you, when you see me with a big smile like this on my face and this balancing act, holding up four bottles of wine in this new box from Wink, there's the is no way to live. Well, you know, I already took the bottles of wine out. I'm, I may be strong enough to hold up four bottles of wine, but am I that coordinated? No, not at all. But anyway, I have got my brand new box of Wink Wine. I'm so glad that you guys are here to share it with me. And we all know because it's not healthy for Nancy to drink alone. Hi everyone, I'm Nancy and welcome back to my channel. Thank you guys so much for taking a few minutes out of your day to spend with me. It means more to me than I can ever let you know. I appreciate you guys so much, so thank you from the bottom of my heart. If you're new to my channel, I hope you would take a quick second hit that little red subscribe button over there. I would love to have you come back and join us for future videos. Your comments, of course, are always welcome. I so enjoy reading your comments and just getting to know each other back and forth through our comments. It means it really, it's a really great YouTube family that we have, how we all support each other. And again, I hope you give this video a thumbs up that really helps my channel grow so thank you guys so much for that so anyway today we are going to be can you tell i got a big smile on my face yeah i know you do you notice that so anyway i have got my 16th box of wink wine it's got four bottles in there that they recommended for me so anyway i still have no idea what's going on with wink but i am just going business as usual i'm going to have the information below if you use my link you are going to get your first four bottles for 29 95 um, there'll be a website that you go to from that link it's going to ask you different food related questions from there they curate a box of four wines for you um, you do not have to take those bottles that they curate for you even if you go through the test and you decide no I really don't want to do this you, you're not obligated to do anything you can of course choose to purchase those bottles again 29.95 if you know the different wines that you like or know things you want to try you're welcome to do that too anything on the website again your first four bottles are going to be 29.95 if you do use my link i get a free bottle of wine thank you very much but um if you just go to the website without using anybody's link you're going to get that same offer just nobody gets a free bottle of wine if you decide to stick with it the next month again they're going to recommend some bottles for you you can take out those bottles or you can opt to get your own or you can skip um, after the initial $29.95 the next box is going to be $59.95 shipping is free on both those boxes they do give you options to try some bottles that instead of maybe being $13.99 each they're like $14, $15, $16, 18 and they do go up so then you would just pay a little bit extra for that which I have done a few times otherwise I just kind of stick to the basics and just do the $59.95 Alrighty, I'm going to have um, my first Wink Wine video up there. I was so excited to open this. And again, I started this in January of, I believe it was 22. And again, this is going to be my 16th box. I'll also have a playlist at the end so that you can see all the different bottles of wine that I've had and the different get-ups that I've worn with it. It's just a really fun experience and just kind of trying to pair different foods and just, just have some fun with it. Alrighty, so this is like the I think the first time that all four bottles that I have this month are all from California. I've got a Cabernet Sauvignon from a company that I think I've just had like some Pinot Noir from. Absolutely loved it, so I was really excited to try their Cabernet Sauvignon. I got a bottle of Rosé from a company that I've had a red blend from them a few times really like that, so I'm excited to try that. And then I what else did I get? A red blend another red blend from a company that I've had a red blend from but this one is a different different year so we're excited to see what that is this one we are going to have from the wonderful wine company it's an orange flavored wine and I've already taken the cap off so I wouldn't make any additional noise 
and it's called the 2020 Malvasia Bianca, which I just mean, I think it means it's a sweet wine, but it does have some orange flavoring, flavoring in here. I'm excited to try that. They had a recipe paired with this that really looked good, and it was a forbidden rice blend with a Thai coconut lime dressing. Again, that really sounded good. It looked good, but there was just so many different ingredients in there that I kind of stay away from those because I don't want to buy something, buy a new new oil or a new spice and then put it in my cabinet and it sits there and sits there. I've got a kitchen downstairs that I haven't been into since I things happened and I just, you know, we didn't need to be downstairs anymore and I came back upstairs. I've got spices in there that I probably need to go down there with a trash barrel and throw things out. I know why I have two kitchens, right? It, it made sense at the time. So anyway, so what I decided to do for dinner, I am going to have these frozen things from Innovation. So I've got this orange chicken, and the chicken in here will be good for a few meals. And I do love that. And also, I usually get their sticky rice when I buy their rice, but um, they didn't have it this time. So I had uh, my shopper from the Target Home Shopping grocery shipped person. She picked out the uh, vegetable fried rice. Again, it's really, really good. So that's what I'm going to have for my dinner tonight. And we've got, got it in my bowl here so I don't spill it. And I've got more in the kitchen. But again, this is going to be a few meals for me. So I'm going to enjoy having that. Alrighty, so let's pour the wine. See what we can sniff. And I've got a new glass tonight to goes with my outfit, doesn't it? So this is from my last vinyl. I don't know if I'm going to post this before or after the vinyl, but anyway, it says fancy another, and it's like a navy blue on top or a bright blue. And then like an opera, it goes down like to like a light blue, almost like a whitish kind of milk glass. And then the writing's in gold. So I'm not gonna talk, well, it's a white one, so I don't really need to check out the color for you guys. So let's pour some in here. And again, it's from the wonderful wine company. Just got a little bit in my glass here. I'm gonna just kind of swirl it around, see if those flavors, <coughs> sorry about that, will unleash for me. I smell like peach. I thought it was gonna be orange, but I, I'm smelling peach. I could be wrong. Maybe apricot, maybe peach, maybe maybe a little orange, but I'm not really positive on that. The peach is what I can sense the most of. Anyway, cheers everyone. Happy Friday. Once it swirls around in your mouth, and it starts to get to the back here you can that citric acid you can really taste it that's where that orange kind of comes alive with the peach probably the apricot is what i'm tasting too it's a little dry at first um you can feel it dry right at the top of your palate and right around here but then there's so much acidity from the fruit sets when it starts to move back here your mouth starts to water and you just kind of forget all about that it was kind of dry at first i'm going to say it's it's not sweet Maybe they call it semi. I'm going to say for me, it's more dry, but I think with the fruits, they're going to, and because the label kind of insinuates sweet, I think they're going to say semi-sweet, but to me, it's, it's really dry on the drier side, but you, you do kind of sense those fruits in there. I think it's going to go good with my orange chicken. going to have another little quick sip. Cheers. Yeah, I mean, you can definitely taste the fruits, but to me, the dryness really takes over more of the sweetness from it. But again, it's going to be a nice little sipping wine to have with my dinner. Alrighty, so let me get my cheat sheets over here. So again, this is the 2020 Wonderful Wine Company. They're calling it Orange Wine Malvasia Bianca. Um, I, they don't say how many people uh, tasted it and rated it. They just say it's got a rating of 3.6 out of five. They're saying it's a medium body. They're saying it is dry. Okay, I thought they were going to say it was sweet, but it's dry. And 13% uh, alcohol. They say the tasting notes are apricot, orange peel, 
white flowers, and white peach. It says it's uniquely styled orange wine. It's a real treat for, I don't know how to say this, or even what it means, onophiles who are looking to expand their horizons. The underlying ethos to all of Wink's winemaking is our belief that great wine starts with great grapes. Our respect for the raw product is reflected in our minimal intervention practices. We are champions. We are the champions of respectful winemaking, and we're providing the commitment by bringing you this Malvasia that's bottled without added sugars. Wonderful wine company Malvasia represents one of our favorite category for adventurous drinkers, orange wine. Made from white grapes, but with skin contact during fermentation, a la red wine. Uh, this fun, funky bottling has notes of citrus, white flowers, and a minerally finish. Don't be afraid to dip a toe into the world of orange wine. You might like what you discover. It says how to serve it chilled, and I did uh, put this in the refrigerator this morning. It says it pairs well with Thai, veggies, fruits, and fries. So anyway, I am excited to try this. I'm going to have a little bit of chicken here and then have wash it down with my wine. See how it is. You grab my fork. I think I cut a piece off so I wouldn't be chewing forever in front of you. So I got a little piece here. It is good. I'm going to have it with a little bit of rice. And cheers, everyone. Again, a great wine to try. Great little dinner to have with it. Happy Friday night, everyone. I hope you guys all go out. Have a great, great weekend. I want to thank you guys again for stopping in, spending some time with me. I really do appreciate it. I just feel so blessed, so lucky to have you guys in my life. I hope you have a great weekend. Take care, everyone. Stay safe. Be kind. Be happy. Enjoy life. Have some fun. I love you guys so much, and we will see you in our next video. Bye-bye.